Another Minecraft video tutorial. It's been a while since the last video and I truly apologise for that. But today we have a slightly different and very exciting video to show you guys because I have made something really awesome. This is the Daylight Sensor button. I saw a Zuma Voice video on his channel, the link will be provided in the description box down below, which was made for to turn this daylight sensor into a button. So I was very interested if I could compact this down and I just did it. I don't know how but I did it. So if I, if I just click this daylight sensor as I, as you can see I got other than output and if I click this here again I will get the output again. As you can see the, the just like the mechanism itself is really compact. I've never made something that cool that compact. I'm really happy about it. So I know lots of you there want to build this thing, but I'm not going to talk more, and I'm going to go straight on to the tutorial. Alright, to build this thing, you're going to need 7x3 area. I've got a bit with uh, blue wool. So what you want to do now is to place a redstone dust on the corner where you want to place your redstone uh, daylight sensor. Then you're going to place daylight sensor on top of it, and a comparator taking output from there with a blob running into it. Then what you want to do is to place dropper there, oh dropper there, and hopper there with a comparator with a block with a repeater running into some sort of kind of a redstone output. I'm going to use redstone lamp for this one. And as you can see, uh, as I've got here, I'm going to use redstone torch to do this with a redstone torch on next to that block with a dropper and hopper running into it. Now you want to chuck in one item per, uh, I just did two, one item per dropper like that, like so, and you want to run out comparator and run into a block, so that will be our resident output done. So the only thing left to do is to place another dropper facing up in that direction, running into uh, taking output from that dropper with a comparator which will eventually when there are more items and stronger less uh, pulls but then that that will turn off and that will power on so I'm going to chuck in three full stacks of items and 51 too so let is time to test it I think so if I click this daylight sensor as you can see the lap turns on so I click, click it again the daylight sensor turns off again so i hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you need please be sure to hit that like button and if you really 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 enjoyed it make sure to subscribe thanks for watching bye bye and the only thing i want to say to you now i'm your huge fan i hope you enjoy this and you know there's nothing more to say bye